Welcome everyone to another episode here of Jaws Podiatry. Something I haven't really done, which we do a lot here. Treatment of onychomycosis, also known as toenail fungus. To uh, fungus among us. Aside from heel pain, aside from Achilles tendonitis, and all of the other wonderful things that we do here at Jaws Podiatry. At the top of the list, top three toenail fungus. We see a lot and a lot of fungus. Miami, the temperature, the climate, moisture, humidity. It's sort of the perfect place for fungus to thrive and survive. We have a young gentleman here. This is actually the same gentleman that we that we just did the the other procedure, and I I'm deciding to to separate both videos on purpose so I can put this one out. And for the people that want to watch only this one, great. And for the other people that want to watch also the other video, if they want to, it's going to be also posted as well. Very briefly. In the toolbox for fungus, we have it all here at Jaws Podiatry. Um, newer is not always better. I've, uh, we, we use laser as an alternative. We have something called a pathformer. It's the only uh, robotic micro drill in the state of Florida. We're the only office that actually has that machine. And the pathformer, I'll, I'll definitely, we're not doing the pathformer today. But in a nutshell, what we basically do with the pathformer, right? If this is, you know, let's just say this is the nail from the side and this is from the top, what we basically do is, is we make these little, right, pathformer, we're forming these little paths onto the nail plate. Um, in this case, this, the entire nail would be affected, but if we had a nail, that it was this was the only part that it was affected we would only go ahead and, and do these little tiny little holes for two reasons number one um, <clears throat> creating these these little pores or holes or or little funnels allow the oxygen to actually penetrate underneath the nail bed which is um, which is important because fungus historically doesn't really like that environment where there's a lot of oxygen um, and it loves moisture number two it allows a topical medication to actually penetrate through the nail. The nail plate is a barrier, so it makes sense. If you, if you guys want more information, just our website has a really uh, a good amount of information at www.jawspediatry.com, and you can learn more about the pathformer. But in this particular case, uh, we're actually just um, using the um, the laser, and aside from the laser. We're gonna go ahead and, and use oral terbinafine, the oral lamisil pill, which is uh, very, very effective. And I like to pulse dose it, uh, but without further ado, and it works really well, that's why we pulse dose it instead of historically, you know, people, a lot of people are afraid of that oral terbinafine, the oral lamisil pill, because it's, uh, you know, uh, in, the, in the minds of people, it is impending doom to the liver, right? No, it's not really like that. Um, yes, it is metabolized by the liver, but um, that's why we pulse dose it. Small amount of pills, 10 pills a month. Um, it has worked really, really well for not only myself, but for some other colleagues as well. So without further ado, make sure that the patient has his or her uh, Gucci Prada Chanel glasses on. Um, you know, I will also, the only problem that I have is I have to take off my glasses, right? In order to put my blue blockers, you gotta love them. So, you know, I want, um, people think that, oh, it's just, it's just laser, right? It's no big deal. Come, come closer here. I wanna show everyone that, you know, laser is laser. It really is laser energy, right? Let's go ahead and turn it on. So look very carefully, see if you can get a good picture of this. You see, can you get a picture of that? So it is burning, right? It's actually burning my hairs, okay? 
the laser, there's a spectrum. We're not gonna get into the physics of laser, but it's really attracted to dark colors. Nonetheless, um, we're gonna go ahead and, for this particular patient, we're gonna go ahead and I'll just show you guys like one nail. I don't wanna bore you guys, but the purpose of the laser energy is essentially to to basically vaporize the fungal spores, the spores of the fungus. And we usually start at a very, very low, okay? And this particular gadget has these two little prongs which help you, basically you can't get closer, right? Because then you can actually burn the skin. So, you know, and the way that it works is I tell the patient, you know, you may feel a little bit of burning here and there that it's going to get warm i usually <clears throat> excuse me i usually stop just like that because i know it's already getting warm it's a cumulative energy heat energy so that means that even though i stop it's still there warm and it'll continue to accumulate and what we're doing is make sure we get a clear picture because if not I wanna make sure that all my viewers get a really, really, really great view. Do we have a great view there? Okay, good. So, you know, obviously the area that's affected the most, and it's a grid-like. You go like this, and then you go like this, and that way, you know, you can't miss a spot, okay? And I can actually And I can actually, you know, create my own settings. So right now the patient's quite comfortable. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pump up the volume a little bit more there. And you know, I actually pioneered um, the first laser in South Florida. Which was called the pinpoint laser. That was about eight years ago. And it was uh, very unfortunate because the company came out with this brand new technology and, and the, the research behind it was not very sound. It was very, very, I was very disheartened by it. So, you know, when people ask me, oh, you know, we know that, that you essentially brought that, la you know, laser, at, you know, laser for toenail fungus to Miami. I mean, what were your thoughts? And, and I have mixed feelings. So what I decided to do is basically just have a little laser in the office that not only does you know, the treatment for toenail fungus, but also we use this laser for some um, physical therapy modalities and so on and so forth, so. If anyone has any questions, I'm gonna stop here just so I can finish all the other uh, nails that are affected. And like always, uh, www.jawspodiatry.com, Instagram, Dr. Toejam, Jaws Podiatry for our Facebook channel. and Jaws Healthcare for our YouTube channel. Have a nice day.